Welcome back to my channel, Victoria's Creations. Today we have a very different type of video we're doing. We um, did a fundraiser, and within the span of two days, I got $85 to buy stuff to fill care packs for homeless people. So I'm going to go through and show you guys everything I got for the homeless packs. Uh, starting with, we went to a thrift store and we bought a whole bunch of these really awesome cinch bags. I think I found 13 of them. They're all 50 cents each. So I, I have enough stuff to make 10 bags, but I grabbed the extra three just so I have them for the next round. But yeah, we were able to get a bunch of these for 50 cents each. Most of this stuff is from the Dollar Tree and Big Lots. So from Big Lots, we were able to get three of these, um, what the heck are these? Cheese and peanut butter sandwich crackers, three packs, eight in each pack, $1.50 each. Uh, I do have a bunch of granola bars left over from the last batch of stuff, so that's not really included in the total, but those are gonna go in the bags as well. From the Dollar Tree, we were able to get 10 little first aid travel kits. We also got these travel toothbrushes that are disposable. They advertise that you don't need water on them, so it would be perfect for somebody who just needs to brush their teeth real quick and doesn't have access to running water. Got those. From Amazon, I was able to get emergency blankets. I got 10 for $10, so those are going to go into the kits. Big box, I got a 12 pack of assorted cookies. This was $4.99. They also had some clearance stuff. I was able to get 10 of these for 33 cents each. We, from the Dollar Tree, we got some antiperspirants and deodorants to put in the bags. From Big Lots, I got a 24 pack of Nature Crunch Valley bars. This pack of water, I think, was like $3.69. These peanuts were at the Dollar Tree, so we got 10 of those. And then also from the Dollar Tree, we got a three-pack of socks. So I feel like this is going to be a really awesome bag to fill up. So let's just fill one of these up. Let me try to untangle them here. Gotta remove these, that, these uh, thrift store tags off of them. Okay, so we'll put in the band-aids, toothbrushes, antiperspirant, the blanket, peanuts, a pack of socks. We'll throw in three granola bars. And then let me open up this water here. We'll throw in two bottles of water. And then we can do two of these cheese things. someone holding a sign saying they need help I will give them one of these bags I've been doing this for a few months now especially with COVID um, a lot of people have been having a hard time so anytime I see anyone holding a sign saying they need help I usually have a bag in my car I've never had them filled with this much stuff though so this is really exciting it was before this it was just two bottles of water some granola bars graham crackers and chips uh, now we can put all of this awesome stuff in um, 
if I get more money, which if you want to donate, leave it in the comments. I will get you a link to that. What I also would like to do is just put like five bucks in each bag. That way they can go to McDonald's or Burger King or somewhere, get themselves a sandwich, something warm to eat. Um, but yeah, th this is what you guys were able to um, get me with all the money you donated. So I'm really thankful for everyone who did donate. I'm going to get the rest of these bags packed up. And then we're going to go ahead and put these in the car. And when I'm out and about, start giving them away. Um, from what I have seen with people who have been getting bags from me, they are so, so, so thankful. Um, so yeah, you guys are definitely helping me change people's lives. So again, thank you. Um, but yeah, I'll see you for the next video. Hopefully it will be a sewing video next time. I know it's been a while, uh, but <laughs> we've been busy. Everyone's been busy. Uh, so stay tuned. I do have some stuff in the works for sewing videos. Have a good day, guys. Bye.